Right, we are at Blossom Road now. As you can see, nice quiet residential road. There's your neighbours. And this looks like it's converted to, to they've taken the garage in. Um, but driveway, which after the last couple we've seen is, is nice. Quite a cute little space. And we are into covered porch area and front door into the main living room. Again, there's a really musty smell in here. Um, older windows still, crank windows. Uh, they've redecorated to a certain extent wood flooring. So it's very pretty as you walk in and then you've got a little lip here into your kitchen and breakfast room area just if I can pan around a little bit there this this strikes me as the type of place that they, they're flipping that they they put kitchen and bathrooms in and redact um, but not done the big things like the windows so you've got reasonable cabinets here actually it looks as if they just replaced the front of some of these and um, very rough finish on the plaster there and some cracking there um, that would be where your fridge freezer went and you've got a little window out and that would be your oven and microwave so no room for a dishwasher by the looks of it uh, into your utility area and there you have your air handler and water heater door to the rear and plumbing and venting for your washing machine uh, and your dryer and it looks to me like they've painted over all these pipes so that would need to be looked at right so that's the sort of kitchen and breakfast area. If we carry on to the rear, we are into bedroom, into your closet. Two closets. And you are round and into your bathroom area. As I said, it looks as if it's one where they, they've redone the kitchens and bathrooms. But I have to say the workmanship is not that fantastic. But you could probably rent this out immediately without putting sort of forty, fifty thousand dollars into it to start to tidy it up. Right, coming round again, we're back into our main living area and swinging round. The wood floors continue, and you've got two bedrooms and a bathroom this size. So you've got your closet there, uh, not a terribly large bedroom, but sufficient, clean and tidy. You have got your third bedroom here, again not the largest bedroom. And actually, we'll just get there a shot of the roof. Uh, definitely, some of the shingles are lifting, and there's a lot of leaf coverage. And you can see, you know, the trees are great for the shade, but the leaf cover can be a bit of a nightmare. So that's the third bedroom, and then you're into a little linen closet there, and then into your second bathroom again they've replaced the sink and they put new tiling that bath does not look new to me it looks like it's been cleaned up and it's cleaning up again so they've done the things that are going to catch people's attention they've done the flooring they've redecked they put in kitchen and bathrooms but they've left the big stuff the roof hasn't been done and the windows are the old crank windows. But as I say, you could probably pop something into here reasonably quickly um, because it's nice, clean, tidy. 
and you know, and I know what we've seen recently, that's hard to come by.